As this album nears its release, I've been thinking a lot about the generous support of friends and family and my church community, and I just wanted to say thank you for that. About 75% of the work on the album, uh, from the musicians who played to the mixing engineers and those who mastered it, about 75% was done by volunteers, just friends who generously donated their time and talent to the project. I, I, I literally could not be at this spot without you. And to top it off, I still have some of you asking, is there anything more that I can do to help? And in response to that, I'm just super humble. But the truth is, and as humbling as it is to say, just as I wouldn't be here now if it wasn't for those musicians, I can't take this to the next step without the rest of your support. Let me give you a little backstory. You see, even though the generosity of so many musicians and engineers helped to keep the cost of this album low, there are still inevitable costs with the process of making an album. And the fact is, as an independent artist, I have to foot the bill for that. So for this album to actually happen, I personally had to go all in. To raise the funds for the final steps of production of this album, I ended up selling my guitar amp, selling one of my cherished guitars, multiple guitar pedals, uh, several studio microphones, and other studio equipment. All of these pieces of gear I used to record the album in the first place. And I did it ultimately because I believe in this project. I did it because I trusted that you would believe in the project as well. I also did it because I trust that if God wanted to take this any further, that he would have to show up, that he would have to provide for the future needs of this ministry. And trust me when I say this is just the beginning. Even now I'm sensing God put new songs and new stories on my heart to share that I cannot wait to see what he's going to do in the future. But to do that, I need your support. So you've asked, how can I help? First off, I need your prayers. I need your prayers to share my story boldly and courageously. I need your prayers to, to take these songs and make them more than music. In order for music to have any power at all, the Spirit of God needs to interfere with them in a powerful way. So I ask that you would pray for me and my family for wisdom, for inspiration, for humility, for, for brokenness, for, for honesty, for passion, for power, and uh, ultimately for freedom to tell these stories and sing these songs. Secondly, you can share this album with your friends. Even before the album's out, even now, you can take one of my Facebook posts or Instagram posts and share that with your friends and your community. Once the album comes out, you can uh, share what you like about it on social media or over coffee with a friend. You might consider buying a few extra albums for birthday or Christmas presents. You can head to my website, devinbumstead.com, and check out the merchandise I have available there. Shirts and stickers and, and the CD and a little secret, there is a deluxe edition of the album coming out soon that you can uh, download digitally there. And you can also check out some of the package deals I have there for you and your whole family. Lastly, if you're feeling a little extra generous, there is a spot on my website to donate. Now, donations are never expected, but appreciated more than you can possibly know. Your donations will make it possible to recoup some of the equipment that I had to sell to push this project through so that I'll be prepared to record the next set of songs God is putting on my heart now. In essence, your donations now would help make this ministry take its first big step. And for that, I literally cannot thank you enough. So for all of you who have just given encouragement, love, and verbal support, thank you so much. For those of you who have given financially, thank you so much. Uh, for, for all of us, I truly hope that you are simply blessed by these songs, that you encounter God in them, and that you learn to respond to Him in all of your life. Thanks for hearing me out today. Have a great one. We'll see you soon.